say good morning. It is Saturday. Right? Mommy, um, yes, babe? I'm bigger. Okay. On Saturdays, we have tennis. So that's what we're going to do today. Sloan has tennis, then we're going to go to the botanical gardens. They have like a honeybee society event. So that's what we're going to do today. Yesterday I was supposed to get, so um, I started, um, I guess I didn't start really, but I don't know. I have monarch butterflies, so I have milkweed plants everywhere. And... I noticed that hornets would go to my milkweed plants and kill and eat the baby caterpillars. So I got these. And I started collecting the caterpillars and putting them in there on the milkweed plants. Um, I literally have like 42. So hopefully they do well. Um, my milkweed is down there. I don't know if you can see it. That's my little milkweed patch that, um, I get my caterpillars from so that they will survive. You can see them. They're so tiny. So, so, so tiny when they come out of the little eggs. So I collected maybe like 30 something, um, actual caterpillars. And then I probably had like... Maybe like, not 10, but uh, uh, somewhere around there, like 1 to 10, 8 to 10, I don't know, eggs. Um, I'm going to get my stuff together. Okay. Oh, and I got these lashes to try. I'll show you guys later. I'm going to try those lashes. I'm like, I need to look like I used to look before I had kids because now I don't have eyelashes. I don't get my nails done regularly. And I feel like I need to change that. But okay, we're coming down right now. Okay. Yes, babe. Okay. Two many minutes. Okay. I don't see her wings then. Go because I can't think. I need to find my waist thingy because it has their EpiPens in there. I just remember, I'm gonna put her in and then come back and get those. This child, every time. It doesn't matter the diaper. It doesn't matter the diaper. It doesn't matter how long we're in the car. Nothing matters. Okay, I know. Okay, babe. Come here. I know. Bless you, babe. Bless you. Okay? Every time we get in the car, this child has a blowout. And I should have known because I heard her like rumbling before we got in the car. Our coach. Come on out, this is the coach. Okay, so we're still at Sloan's tennis practice, but I've noticed that people will point out when she calls a man dad, because I think they like to point out the fact that like she doesn't have a dad and she's looking for a dad. But yesterday she said, brother did such and such to me when this boy did something to her. And she said, sister, 
who does she call a sister? At the um, museum. Someone at the who? The little girl in the little vet area. Oh, she had all the oh yes, sister wouldn't share something with her. So she just calls people by like what their role would be like in a family. Well, she's at a tennis practice. <laughs> Maya, you go to your. <laughs> Why is trying to use my Darth Vader voice. <laughs> 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 so, um, there's a new coach. Well, a newer coach. And he, I don't, I guess he hasn't told them his name. He may have, and we don't remember. Um, so my mom's talking to Sloan, and she says, <laughs> so funny. She says, um, Sloan says to my mom, where's dad's name? <laughs> my mom said, that's the coach. That coach. No, 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 no. You don't need to ask him what his name is. Just that's all you need to call him. Actually, it's coach. What's dad's name? <laughs> so she's gonna have to change her clothes. Look at her. But I realized I had this matching outfit for both of them. So they're both gonna change because Sloan's sleep keeps falling down. And I'm whoa. I don't like how. Promiscuous, I don't know if that's the right word, but like, I don't like how flirty it looks. Like, yeah, well, the sl her her strap won't stay up. Like, it looks like a little bra strap falling down. Let's see what she does. Good job, Sloan. Go back to your dot, baby girl. Go back to your dot, sweetie. I'm winner. I'm winner. Yeah, yeah. I'm winner. Woo. City mama. Sidra was sleeping. Um. So we just got to the Botan Botanical Gardens. It's a honeybee festival. So I'm actually excited to see like if they have any plants that um, pollinators really like. Or what else? What else am I wanting to see here? I said plants for pollinators. Do you want to bring the stroller? I think Sloan's going to walk, don't you think? I think so. Everyone's getting strollers out now. I'm getting nervous. Huh? So people are getting strollers out now. I'm getting nervous. <laughs> How do we get to the honeybee part? Oh, maybe keep that Walk one. down the street. Ah! It's like a two-lane road. They should have paths. With no edge. Or maybe That's they what should I'm tell us. Ask this are we walking down here? Yeah. The path, okay. Okay, thank you. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Um, we have our little mosquito repellent bracelets on. Sidra has one on her foot. Mm -hmm. I'll come back when we get to the festival after Stone literally woke up from her nap and said I want to go to the jungle We are in the jungle aren't we? Right Sloan? Yeah Okay, wait. okay. You ready? Yeah. Boom 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 what? what? You're supposed to be doing your Simone Biles. Oh, you're doing your Simone Biles routine. No? Can we get down? They're walking that way, Mom. Lord. Jesus. We're, we're following them. I'm not following two, two people when 20 people going this way. 
Yeah. That could be it. Okay. Yeah. Alright, now I'm really going to come back to you guys when we're at the actual festival. Honey's going to see the butterflies, babe. We made it to the butterfly house. Dan, I'll close it after. Go ahead, babe. <laughs> See, these are the nectar for you for the butterfly. Wow. Sloney, you excited? Yeah. This is why I make her do some stuff. <gasps> you can pet them. Sure. We have some of these at our house, right, Slo? We must have mostly. Yes, a lot yeah. of mostly. Look, a bunch there of caterpillars in. And OMG. Yeah, and they're protected in here. We've had to get um, little, like, net cages and take them off the milkweed because the wasps. Wasps. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, they're very they crazy. Right, that's why we have the double door. Yes. Right. Let me see. Over here too. We have lots oh, of yeah. these. Oh yeah, wasps. I mean, butterflies. Oh wow, that's huge. Where's the little ones you saw? I saw a little, little ones. A lot of here. times they're like right in the top. Yeah, there's one. Oh, there's a little that's one. bigger than yours, yeah. too, though. She has tiny, yeah. tiny. There might be some more. This one has some. Oh, look, there's milkweed here, too. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, there's a tiny, tiny one, like, right in there. Oh, yeah. You see it? And, yeah, okay. those are zinnias. Okay, so this. Mom, those are. Uh, yeah, don't take it from this one was doing that thing, so maybe you can ask her why they this You guys, I saw another, I found another chrysalis where my mom found it. Oh, you cannot, it's not even cute on camera. Like, you cannot get it for you. Yeah. I was gonna see if this is a chrysalis. Not a monarch chrysalis. Oh no, I think it's just dirt or something. This place is so if you, cute. If you were looking for monarchs chrysalises, there are a couple back here. And there's two monarchs that have recently come out. So oh we got gosh. two chrysalises and one that's about to come out. And this guy just came out about 10, 15 Shut. minutes ago. Shut. Oh, it's coming out right now. Up. It looks like in yep. the um. And this guy oh is my. only about two or three hours old. <gasps> So oh he my is not goodness. flown away yet. He's just still waiting for his wings to fill up. So do you guys Oh my goodness. Do you guys yeah, bring them over here when you find them? Um it's mostly we try to keep them within the house so that we know where they came from and how they were processed and things like that. And so at the beginning oh, of the season we start with local. I know, don't touch it. I was just Yeah. yeah okay. And it, this guy was completely black right. before he started to split open. I yeah. cannot, I out. never got to see it come out. You did, yeah, mine. I did, but yeah. Oh my gosh. They okay, so, oh, oh Jesus. So yeah, we're not really sure though. that one's very healthy because he seems to keep falling down and his wings don't seem to be Because I was going to say, the ones inflating. I saw, the wings didn't stay like that very long. They were like this yeah, almost immediately. Yeah, within a short period of time. Yeah. yeah. And this one, he's like two to three hours old. Right, yeah. Happens, though, yeah, right? like, nature. That's and these are old, correct or no? Um, these look they nice look and like they've green. Been here since, most of these have been here since I've been coming. Okay. Since June, July. Um, um, I'm not sure that they're going to hatch out. Yeah, um, that's but it is really interesting to look at them because you can see sort of a goldish color mm -hmm. on these. You know, the monarchs have the gold dots on yeah. them, but those have, or they look a little more gnarly, but they still have the gold dots. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Yeah. 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 So yeah, I put my milkweed out and immediately got eight caterpillars. Look 
babe. Show them what you got. What is it? It's honeybee. It's honey. She got a honey stick. I'll let her look at it, babe. And I got um, more plants. Got more milkweed. And this is calamenta. But they say that the pollinators really like it. Sloan has soap all over her hands. And she's getting honey. Or soap all in her honey stick. Look. Babe, squeeze from the bottom. You're gonna need soap in your mouth. I got soap? Yeah. So what you've got is a lot of these bees, those small ones walking uh -huh. around, those are females. Okay. There's a couple males in here. Okay. Let's see if I can turn the light on. Yeah, show see, me. Let's see. See these ones right here, these big, big hairy ones, the big ones right there? Just the, sitting there doing nothing? Doing nothing. <laughs> That's right. The bees, the, you got it right. So the, the male bees, right, they only have one purpose, is to mate with their virgin queen. So in this hive, right? All of the men mate with the one queen? Well, not. So, what happens in a hive, let's, let's talk about the springtime. When the hive, Do you, you mind if I record you? Yeah, go okay. ahead. So when the bees uh, swarm, you hear people calling out, I got bees swarming around right now. That's because the hive got too crowded. Oh. The queen and the worker, so the workers told the queen, you're leaving with half the workforce. And they're looking for a new home. So they left, what they did was, when the queen left, she left her house with <coughs> queen cells, these little cells, yeah, the big it's cells. It's in there. there may be four or five of them in, in the hive. As they hatch out, those are virgin queens. Mm. Now they're sisters. And it's called, now it becomes the royal rumble. Only one of them are going to survive. Wow. So they, they start chirping. This is, Look, this is like real life. Oh, this is, this is, this is, this is brutality. <laughs> the <laughs> sisters start fighting each other. They do. And the, the one that is a superior one survives, right? Wow. And now she has a, she has a house. Hi. She's got food and workers. Wow. And she hasn't made it yet. Okay. Mm. Right? So now she has to go on a mating flight. Mm. And they mate in flight. Oh. So she will leave. Right? And remember, she's got brothers in there too, right? And they're looking to mate. All right? But her here, brothers were going to mate with her? Well, no. This is how they get around it. So the, the, the brothers, right, are big, right, they're slow. They can only fly so far. She flies. She's further than that. She flies further than She's looking to mate with the surrounding hives. God, her here, friend's brothers. Right? And she wants the genetics. Okay. So right. she, and she doesn't mate with one. She will mate with 15 to 20 different drones wow. in flight. And in, she, in separate flights? It like could be separate that? flights. Okay. It could be the same flight. Okay. Right? It all depends. If she gets it all in one, one shot, right? One flight, she makes it 15 to 20, maybe more, until she's got enough that she feels that she can you know, survive. Because remember, she, she's going to be a queen for a good period of time. Up to three so she only mates one time. Well, she, oh, wow. she has, she has, she may make a couple, she may have a couple of mating flights, but once she does it, right? She's she feel, done. She's done. Got she it. fills up her sperm seeker, right? Wow. She holds all that sperm in her. And when she goes to, when she goes to lay an egg, she will determine the size of the cell. If the cell is big, right, she will lay an unfertilized egg and that will be a drone. If the size of the cell is a smaller size cell, she will lay the egg and add sperm to it and that will be a worker. Shut. No. How do they know? Oh, Mom, you're not even listening. I was listening, but I'm she, also trying to hear. She also can lay anywhere between five and 2,000 eggs a day. <gasps> oh my God. Remember, she, she needs a big workforce. Go ahead, Sloan, get it. She needs a big, huge workforce. Wow. Okay. So that's what that's what she's trying. So how long do um, queens typically live? Well, back in the early, early times, a long time. Now, if we're lucky to keep a queen two years. Actually, I got a cluster. They'll, they'll, they'll last longer. They'll, la they'll last longer, but about two years is what we usually get out of it. Okay. So she'll, on a What's this one doing? What's that? That's trash, and he's trying to take the trash out. Oh my goodness. See this one here? This piece of grass there? He's trying to take the grass out. So if this hive. Where do they go? Where are they going? Well, what they're trying to do is take, take it out. Take it out, but there's no out. There's no out. Okay. So once we take, <laughs> it, once we take this back to the, the parent hive and we put it back together, right, they'll haul that trash out. So at your um, meetings, do you, do the people who come to the meetings get to handle bees? So we don't do we don't at the meetings that, that we do each month, right? It's educational, right? But you can if you join the club, you can sign up. To so now we're done for the day. My camera is literally about to fall off the stand. I don't know. It's like I need to. Am I in view? Yes. <laughs> okay.
um, we just took that shuttle back to our parking area. Thank goodness, because oh goodness, we're gonna have to walk on the street. I started to get like a little migraine, and I'm like testing out migraine medicine, but I had a coffee and some food, and it went away. I had water too. Water. I probably had two things of water. Some lemonade. The lemonade I thought was gonna be so delicious. They sweetened it with honey, and it was so sour. So sour. Sloney, how was that lemonade that I gave you? Was it sour or sweet? Sweet. It was sweet. It was sour. It was sour. Take it from me. <laughs> go ahead, Sloney. Go catch it. It was phone. sour. My phone or my camera's about to die. So I'll get back with you guys. This Once I charge sweet. it. That one was very was sour. This one was. This yeah. Okay, it is almost seven. I'm about to do a spa day with Sloan. This is like the easiest way to get her to like bath, wash her hair, everything. I'm gonna use this. I got this from Target um, and do a hot oil treatment. So I'm gonna give her a bath and wash her hair and then do the hot oil and let her sit under that and then do conditioner and rinse it out at the sink. <sighs> yeah, I don't know if I said that, but um, when I moved all the caterpillars over, there was like 30 some caterpillars, which is a lot. Um, so altogether, I feel like there's, I think there's like 70 something. Um, but yeah, literally just clean today. We were supposed to go do stuff or like I was thinking of planning to do stuff, but we didn't. I'm like, we could just stay home. So that's what we did. All right, Sloan and I are out of the shower. I'm about to put, I think I'm gonna do vitamin E, this one. I got it from Whole Foods. And I don't have coconut oil. Okay, I'm gonna do these two. Sloan, can you turn that down, please? Or put your headphones on. Um, no. have this towel down so that um Sloan's not cold when she's laying down I'm getting her hair down. And I'm gonna actually I might just leave it like this. Um put it in her scalp and then put the bonnet dryer to work it all in there. This is actually what I'm gonna do. I got this little um what did I buy that paper? Oh I was trying to do a quick leave once. And I bought the little paintbrushy thing that people use, to, you know, to like color hair. So I'm gonna use that. I keep trying to spot it. Every time I describe it, I go like this. We're gonna wash, we're gonna put lotion on, and then and I do like that. And then I'm gonna um, like do her hair and nails. She's like, okay. <laughs> oh, girl, girl, please be excited. Okay. Um, let's see what this thing looks like. Stickers.
This was from Target. Jesus, I think that's the back. To try it on you first. What are you trying to do? This blow dryer. <laughs> so the S L O A N is not S C A R E D. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm gonna have to nurse her or something anyway. Okay. Cause it's gonna be too loud probably. Okay. All right. So I think now I'm gonna put the oil in Stony's hair. Go oh, down, babe. I fall down here. <laughs> no, you didn't. <laughs> Alright, I, I got up at like, it. it was almost 8. Sidra woke up at like 8.30. It is 8.53 and Sloan just woke up. You say morning? Coming. Good morning, everyone. Uh, um, I already made bacon in the oven. I told Sloan she needs to eat, what, bacon, eggs, or oatmeal. You can have bacon and then eggs or oatmeal, right? Um. Which one do you want, eggs or oatmeal? Um, eggs and bacon. Okay, all eggs. All the same. Okay, all the same. Anything else, babe? Um, no. No, do you want something to drink? Yes. What do you want to drink? Apple juice. Okay, let's get some apple juice. Because she will eat a yogurt bar, and then she will beg for ice cream and a lollipop, and it's just like sweet, 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 sweet. No, you need to eat real food. Now let's make a mess. Yeah, let's not make a mess. You're going to help me, right? Yes. All right. I'll put four eggs in here, so you're going to whisk them. So you mix them up, okay? I'll get some salt and pepper to put in there. Faster, faster. You okay? Alright, everyone's plates are made. This is what Citra's happy. Avocado, bacon, and scrambled eggs. Well, I guess we're all having the same thing. <laughs> Avocado, bacon, scrambled eggs. Sloan is doing her lingo kids. I have her do that because... She wants to use her iPad, but it's like, let's do maybe something kind of educational. Um, and then I have eggs and avocado and bacon also. That's what we're having for breakfast. I don't know what we're doing today. My mom asked me the same thing. I'm like, I have no idea. I think it's been a few days since I vlogged, but we are on our way to Sidra's allergy appointment. Hey, mama, mama. Mom saw that we were at a doctor's office. I don't want to go. She's only happy to go to doctors when it's for Sidra. She thought it was for her. Come on, my babe. Hi, mama. Hi, little mama. Come on. Come on, babe. Oh. Hold my hand, Sloan. Mom! 
Let's go. Ready. Okay. I've got her hand. Okay, I'm going to let go, Sloan. You hold Honey's hand. Oh, gosh. I think she's supposed to get an allergy test today. Because so far she's reacted to peanut butter, kefir, and Greek yogurt. The kefir had um, peach flavor in it, so I thought that it was peach that she was allergic to. Because she's had dairy. But, I guess we will see. Alright, so they're asking. Fill paperwork. They're asking. It says, please identify family medical history. Mother, father, sister, brother. Asthma, eczema, food allergies, sinus disease. I think my donor doesn't say anything about that on his profile. Like he doesn't have any of it. I should still go. I can still go look again. It's finished. <laughs> Jesus. And because I could look on my Mac, I could select my Shutterfly photos that I need to print. Oh, there's, they're calling. Um, Sidra was weighed and they got her height. I didn't go back and look at my donor stuff because I already know he told me he didn't have anything. So, I don't know. We have like a jam-packed day, right? We do. Yes, we do. So, I think we're going to do an allergy test today. And then... Ouch, ouch, ouch. You're pulling my hair. Um, what was I going to say? What's this advertising? You want to see Miss Rachel? Stop crying. You want to see Miss Rachel? Alright, so Sidra just... They just administered her allergy test. It just looks like these little pokes on her back. So, um, I know it's milk on the left, a tree nut mix on the right. She's like, what are you doing? Turn around, because your nipple's showing. <laughs> um, and then two pe peanut... Um, tests here. And then there's histamine and I don't know what the S stands the reaction mm, the H one is that's histamine that to, yeah yeah um, I don't know what's this is 15 minutes the yeah. P's are P1 and P2 is peanut mm, we'll see I don't know what S is what's this milk don't touch it I didn't I wasn't touching it I'm pointing Milk, tree nut. So we're at Chick fil A. Sloan just, or not, yeah, Sloan had. Um, uh, 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 oh, gosh. Honey, can you wipe your hand off? Mm -hmm. um, Sloan got sketty or a It was good? Yeah. She actually ordered for herself today at the counter. Um, and Citra had a chicken strip and a couple french fries. Now that we know that her allergy is to peanut proteins. Ow! Jeez, she's cold my hair. Ooh. And peanut oil, I guess, either doesn't have the protein in it, right? Peanut right. oil does not have the protein? She said, right. There's and I guess it's cooked at a high level. Yes, but she also said that they're separated when you press it. Yeah, so she could have chicken. 
Um, and then, so this is stop two, so we stop to eat. Now we need to go to the mall to, oh no, no, no. You go to the post office to return your dress. The mall to return, return, return a different dress. dress. But is there something we have to buy at the mall? So. We could look for clothes for her. Well, yes. For, to get cooler out. And then chiropractor. Then she doesn't know yet. With one of her friends from tennis. Then we have a party that we're going to. I think that's all. You think that's enough? I think for so. one day. <laughs> I have to insert a clip of Sidra eating. You want me to feed you like a giraffe? Okay, here, giraffe. Sidra's six-month photos. Look at this picture I got of Sidra. 
well, all the pictures came out really cute. I used my, what, Canon Rebel T8i. Wow. Here we go. Look at this one. Oh my gosh. So cute. Alright, you guys ready? Because we have to get going. You ready? Yeah! Okay, let's go. Okay, so I'm at um, my IVF clinic. I was not planning to come here today, but we were like right across the street. And. Let me just run Citra in there real quick. Hopefully Dr. Robin's like walking past the front desk mm -hmm. and gets to see her. I've contacted them for a meet and greet, but they say she's so busy. I'm like, just be walking past the front desk, Dr. Robin. Yes. Oh, look at that cute baby! <laughs> oh! Hello. Oh my goodness. Sidra, look. So we contacted um, you guys to try to do a meet and greet with Dr. Robin. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. Oh my goodness. Hello. How are you? Good. Hi. 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 Okay. I'm trying. She's so cute. She's so cute. Oh my I feel like Dr. Robin's going to be obsessed. Yeah. She's she's not. Not. Oh, oh, you got her hair slicked down. Oh, where are your hair? Yeah. It's it's still in the crib, isn't it? Right. So what's funny is I was with my first. I had heartburn like majority of my pregnancy, and she came out with a head full of hair yeah. and kept her hair. She, I had no heartburn, mm -hmm. and like at like thirty six weeks, I'm like she's she's gonna be bald, like <laughs> so sad she's gonna be bald. Hey, oh and good, thank you. <laughs> and I got the worst heartburn for like two weeks. She came out with hair; it all fell out. Oh, oh my goodness! God was like, you know what? Fine, you Fine. wanted yeah, hair. You wanted hair. hair. Yes. Yeah. That's how my second oh, she one. You up and down, uh, she she like, has an RBF. <laughs> Sidra, you're not allowed to cry with Dr. Robin. Oh, sweet. <laughs> Sidra. Oh. Glad to see Dr. Robin. Oh. <clears throat> Dr. Robin is technically the other grandmother. <laughs> that was fun, right, babe? Right? All right, now we're going to finish the rest of our day because we have a lot of stuff to do today. This is one of Sloan's favorite things to do at the mall. 
and every single time we have to find quarters because who has coins anymore? In this city. the chiropractor. I forgot to bring you guys in, but I had to come out and get Sloane's um, gymnastics outfit because she has a trial gymnastics class at 4. It's literally like 3.30. So we're trying to rush and get adjusted. Yeah, I'm, I'm asking you what you think your surprise is. What do you think it is? Camera? Yeah. Nope. Nope. What else? What? Guess again. Uh, a ball. Nope. <laughs> Why would you have to put that outfit on, babe? Hmm. I put outfit. Um, what dress did you just put on? I put... No, not white. Okay, I guess we'll just see when we get there, right? Okay. Okay. All right. Okay, we're here, babe. <laughs> you ready? Yes. You don't even know what it is yet. It's that. It's a surprise. <laughs> Take your arms out. <laughs> Come on, babe. Yeah. Oh, careful, babe. You okay? Oh, oh no. Run. Look, go this way, babe. Go. <laughs> go. <laughs> Let's see what it is. Come on, this way. I like it, You excited? Yeah, it. It's gymnastics. Is it? <laughs> this one, this one, babe. Sloney, I think I have to go check in somewhere. Come on. Okay, we're at our final event for the day. Sloane, did you have fun at gymnastics? Yes. You did? Uh-huh. Who did you see there? I slipped on my tummy. I don't like this. Uh. You did? You did very well. You did the balance beam? Yeah. You did such a great job, babe. I even took videos and pictures of you. You hear me? to a graduation party. So, I have to put in clips of the videos I got of Sloan because I didn't vlog on this camera. Like I just took video clips on my phone. So I'll like insert them in here somewhere. Um, but yeah, I have a tiny little headache because I've not prioritized food today. Um, but yeah, this is the last thing we have to do. It's 5.30. Um, the surprise is for a graduate that is supposed to be here at 6, so we need to get inside. So a surprise party. So let me see how you walk in that outfit. And come back this way. Sloney, and come back this way. Nice. Now, I'm on the court, so I ain't gonna go too far. Okay. <laughs> but I'm still gonna talk to you. Yeah. And I got something I wanna do. Come on.
Now we can chill the vibe, everybody take a dive, you know we at mama house. Family come inside, we can take a ride, baby, cruising, going bruising, and you really know. We going higher than the stars, using all our tippy toes. People know we knowing what I'm gonna do. Put the fiddle for me in and got me. This black man is not here to beat you down or take what's yours. Not looking to undress you, enjoy you, and fade away. He's not looking to pick pockets for petty pennies. This black man, he never waxed up or picked up for Drake because he's here for a long time, not a good time. Mm. To stack funds, not for them fast cars you think we all want. Not for the weed you think we all smoke. Not for the guns you think we all took. Not for the studio to waste time spitting rhymes you think we all wrote. Nah. For the lessons to run up more bread than you could ever think of, allow me to rephrase. To enroll in college classes, yes, I'm going there. <laughs> to earn more capital than your mind could imagine for my first home that I'll give to my children and for them to give to theirs for <laughs> funds to hand down to my heirs. This black man will be fighting not with his fists, but with his mind. Hey guys, it's Saturday. Um, you guys, know, well, I don't know if you guys know, but we do Solomon's tennis on Saturday. And then we went to the zoo with one of her friends. Three, run! <laughs> and we're just getting back. I did not vlog any of that because it was stressful enough being at the zoo with two three-year-olds and a six-month-old. We went with um, her friend and the little girl's nanny. But I'm out here trying to look at these caterpillars. I put one final um, plant in yesterday so they could eat and go to chrysalis. I'm starting to think I'm gonna need another plant. This is crazy. Ooh, they're fighting. I need another plant. Okay, so a few of them went up to start forming a chrysalis. This one is already in a chrysalis. I just don't want to buy more milkweed. I don't want to put them out here. I don't want them to get killed by the wasps. Let's see. Ooh. Oh my gosh, she's laying more eggs. Here she is laying eggs. Let's see if you can see her. There's literally caterpillars everywhere. Everywhere there are caterpillars. I should have given some to Maya. Maybe we'll bring her some tomorrow. Oh, and these aphids are giving me the creeps. But yeah, you can literally see, oh my gosh, caterpillars everywhere. The monarch butterflies. I need to, um, I put in my calamantha. My calamantha, I don't know what, what how the correct pronunciation. Mm. And I'll probably start pulling out these flowers soon. But my mom needs some for bouquets she's making for a meeting. So I'll wait. But I started cutting the grass low. I'm going to put grass seed down. And yeah, that's it. I'm just out here. I'm going to water them real quick because I feel like it's super hot. And I don't want the plants to die. So... Yeah, these are Jay hanging, look. So that's a chrysalis here. And then these are about to start Jay hanging. This one's already Jay hanging. Maybe I'll grab another milkweed. I only need one. Actually, that's a lie, I don't need one, I need a lot. I'm gonna go look at the ones upstairs too. The hummingbirds love these. So I need to pull all these off, deadhead them. Anyways, let me water these flowers. I feel like I do a tour every time I come out here. I'm 
done watering the garden. Sloan's friend that, um, whose party we're going to tomorrow. Um, we need to get her a gift. And Sloan needs an outfit to wear. So, I think I'm going to run to Target. And get those things. City girl. City girl. What's wrong? You're gonna crawl? You have to get up on your knees like this, babe. Look at her. <laughs> you have to get up. Oh. What's he doing? You kind of you coming over here? Okay, show Sidra how to crawl. Show Sidra. You never crawled. You went straight from doing this to walking. I don't like this. I like this. <laughs> try it. Yeah, try it, Sidra. She's trying to. She's trying. Go ahead, Sid. Me away. <laughs> Sidra, not fall over. Um, like nine of the caterpillars are outside Jay hanging. Wow. Um, downstairs. Sorry, she's playing. <laughs> yeah. Sidra had a ball on the way here. What are you upset about? Do you want something to eat? Why does girl say so she can get married or be a wife? What? Okay, one. So we're on our way to a magic show for Maya's birthday party. It's in the garage. Go. Following you. Go. You said the magician's here. <gasps> Ready? Okay, let's see. Sloan, come on, let's get a good spot. Mr. Make It Happen. <laughs> Look at Sloaney. Where's Sloan? <laughs> Here she is. Let me see you. Okay. Harder. Harder? Yes. Yeah. 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 Okay, one second. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I'll get in the car, you tell me where to go. Alright, ready, Sloan? You 
like it? in the pony? So we're back home. I'm about to make, I got stuff yesterday for like chicken bacon ranch wraps. Although yours is going to be with what, salmon or shrimp? Mm. Whichever one. It, I, I will leave them. <laughs> okay with either one. I feel like it should be shrimp because you can just pull it real quick. On the Salmon's thawed out because I already left it out from yesterday when oh, I so bought it. So. Okay. Um, the party was so much fun. Right, Mom? And Sloan had so much fun. Yes. Sloaney, what was your favorite part at the party? Um. Hmm? What was your favorite part? Pause this. You're not even supposed to be watching that. She was having nightmares last night. I'll tell y'all um, about it. So, Mama Maya. Um, Maya's party. Maya's party. So, much fun. Yeah, but remember we went in the water? Yeah. Was that fun? Yeah. We went on, we went on a um, tube, um, like on the back of a jet ski. Scary. Um, but, okay, so about her little nightmare thing last night. So literally like 2, 3 o'clock in the morning, she wakes up, eyes and ears covered, and she says, Mom, I'm scared of the dark. First off, why are you awake? Can't be scared of the dark if you're not awake. 
So why are you even awake? She literally, I feel like she woke up just to tell me that. And so I'm like talking to her at a normal like volume and she keeps saying, shh. You know how when you get scared, you, <laughs> you need people to be quiet. Like, stop talking too loud because if there's people here, they're going to know that we're here. Um, she kept telling me to be quiet. I said, what? And then she would say, Sidra's sleeping. Why, okay. y'all, why isn't everyone sleeping? Right. Why aren't we all sleeping? Because I don't wake up and then go straight back to sleep. I'm up for like an hour, two hours. Like, I don't go back, straight back to sleep. So she kept telling me that. What? And she texts me when she wakes up. Three o'clock in the morning, I get a text on my phone. I hear it. Then I'm up for two hours. <laughs> then we're all up. <laughs> and then we're wondering why we're trying to take a nap at one o'clock in the afternoon. Exactly. Yeah. Um. So... Wait, did I text? Oh, I did text you. I did text her because um, I was telling her that Sloan don't need me on her iPad as much because clearly she's watching stuff that's scaring her. Anyway, so that happened last night. But so we went on the jet ski. I went, tw I went three times. So I went once with, so the little girl's name is Maya and Maya has um, an au pair or a nanny. And her name is Ty. So I went with Ty and Ty's friend. Um, so we went once. And I'm like, do whatever you want. Just don't flip me into this wa water. Sidra doesn't want me to tell this story. What's up, Sid? What's wrong? You want something to eat? Okay, I'm gonna try and tell the story while I'm making these wraps. So the second time I went with Maya's mom and one of her friends. Then the third time I went, we were supposed to take the girls with us. So Maya, Maya's mom, myself, and Sloan. But Maya didn't want to go. Maya wanted to ride the actual jet ski, not go on the tube. So Maya rode the jet ski and Sloan, myself, two other little girls and Maya's mom were on the tube in the back. Listen, when I say I'm holding on for dear life, I do not want to touch this water because it's, it's dirty water. Like it's water in Virginia. The ships be in this water. Like everything is in this water. You need water in there? Cold water? So I'm, I just knew I didn't want to touch the water. That's it. Um, and I already know Sloan is like me. So her memory is going to be on a thousand. I can't let her touch the water either. She'll never let me live it down. And she just doesn't like water like that. Like she likes playing in water. Don't let it touch her face. It's like everything goes downhill after that. So I'm like, they're going to be like like easy on us because they know it's three like little girls they were like three and four years old i'm like they know they're gonna be easy on us because they know like it's little girls on here why did they start whipping that thing so i'm gonna tell you so we were going like a decent speed it was like bumpy fun and then And then they stopped and they were like, oh, fish are jumping out of the water. And I was like, but when you stop, the little tube thing starts to sink into the water. So I'm like, please start going. So I said, faster. And Sloan starts screaming faster. I'm like, we don't need to double it up. They just need to go a little bit faster. <laughs> they started whipping it. So three people fly out of the boat or out of the tube. Y'all need to pause the video right now. Go to the comments and tell me who you think flew out of the boat. Me, Sloan, and someone else. Sloan and two other people. Me and two other people. Or did me and Sloan stay in the tube and three other people flew out? I'm going to wait. Because y'all know we weren't touching that water, okay? When I say me and Sloan was the only ones in that tube, <laughs> my mom said she started recording. 
<laughs> to see what was going on. I'm like, we were not touching that water. I was holding on to feeling so tight. And the only reason why I wasn't holding on to the other girls, well, the, the, the third little girl was furthest away from me. So I'm like, I can't hold on to everybody. I was holding on to Sloan and one other little girl. But that little girl said to me when I held her arm, she said, I'm okay. I'm okay. I was like, okay, she wants to have fun, you know? Let her have fun. She had a life vest on. We all had life vests on. So I let her go. But yeah. Sloan, Sloan would be telling me about that for the rest of her life. One time I said the F word. And I'm only saying it now because I, I don't know if I'm allowed to curse being monetized. But um, she was going to sleep one night and she was just like, Mom said. And said it. I'm like not necessary for you to randomly re repeat this stuff so. but the party was very much fun there was a petting zoo there was a magic show the pool there was a bounce house there was what else garden games oh like um what is that called I can't remember what it's called. It's like a like a beanbag toss. You play at like um tailgate um tailgates and stuff like that. They had soccer. It was it was a lot of fun. Like a good 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 birthday party. I said this is not a good birthday party for Sloane to go to for one of her first birthday parties <laughs> because the expectation is now high. But um, she met this little girl from t um, tennis. Yes? You want a candy? Yeah. Orange candy? Yeah. Oh. Probably wants to nurse. 